Okay. So R. Kelly gets, because uh, that's your boy. Uh, he gets, uh, they give him a, a, a 30 pop. Did they? I think it was 20 or 30 pop. Damn. It was a 30 pop. And you used to live with him, right? That's my boy, man. Okay. Uh, you think that he'll ever come home? Uh, do you think he deserved to come home? Or? I don't what the man, hell, you know, man? man? I mean, I don't... You... Hey, man, my eyes, they never see them. They showed me the man don't deserve to never come home. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. I gotta, I gotta ask you, I, I really wanna ask you about, you know, with, with the way that Fit and all been doing, you know, uh, people, yeah. man. I just want you to just kind of touch on that. Uh, Big Scar R.I.P., uh, Gangsta Boo R.I.P., you hear all these alleged. Yeah. And I'm just trying to understand, you know, what you think about it because you're a guy that's an entertainer like these people that I'm, you know, you really get to hear about the entertainers, but it's really more. It's really more people. You know what I'm saying? I feel like this. I feel like, you know, people that know me, they know I'm a rock star. You know what I'm saying? I, I've definitely partaken in my first year of partying. You know what I'm saying? I've partaken in my first year of partying. And, uh, man, you know, I just feel like it's in a generation of where shit that wasn't cool before is cool now. Like, life-threatening drugs, like doing life-threatening shit wasn't cool when I was, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, I just feel like, you know, I lost a brother to that, you know? Really? Yeah. Long live Baby J. Rest in peace, Baby J, man. I lost my brother, man, and a couple years back, uh, like two, three, four days before Christmas. So, man, I just, I'm just so anti that bullshit, man. Well, I, so, so how, how do you, I mean, cause how do they administer it to you, though? Know? I don't know nothing about, about this no more. I'm kind of out the loop, you know what I'm saying? How do I mean? Is it in a pill form? I mean, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or is it is it laced in they, in whatever they want to lace it in? Know, they might throw it in that cup. You know, no, 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 no. They don't work like that. I don't know what the fuck they doing with it, but I know it's killing their dumb ass. That's what I see. And they need to stop. You know, I ain't an investigator. I ain't heard the goddamn we get. No, nah, I'm trying to figure out how it happened. You I know, I mean, I'm pretty yeah. sure they doing it a couple different ways. You feel? <laughs> you understand me? But goddamn, they doing too much. But e, they got to stop. The thing that I really, you know, I trip off of is, you know, you know, when you be out at the nightclub back in the days, you know, girls yeah. worry about you slipping something in their drink. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Be, being real, like yeah, dudes fact. or whoever, fact. niggas getting robbed. I heard, uh, I think it was Cardi B or somebody talking about putting something in people's drinks and, you know, this is how I'm then, you know, getting, yeah. getting them for their money when she's in a strip club. Oh, yeah, finesse. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. It's doing all kind of hustles out here. Yeah, so, trying to get killed. But, but the fitting all is another level. You know what they I'm saying? They voluntarily doing that motherfucker, you hear me? Yeah, it is yeah. another level, bro. Yeah. Hey man, I just I just, you know, anybody who I heard it's like it's some shit you gotta wing out, you feel what I'm saying? So whatever they doing, man, you know, basically basically you know what's going on, man. Man. <laughs> you know what it is, man. Man. They gotta stop. So okay. So R. Kelly gets uh cause that's your boy. Uh, he gets, uh, they give him uh, a, is it a 30 pop. Did they? I think it was 20 or 30 pop. Damn. It was a 30 pop. And you used to live with him, right? That's my boy, man. Okay. Uh, you think that he'll ever come home? Uh, do you think he deserved to come home? Or? I don't know. What the man, hell, man? Know, man? I mean, I hey, man, my eyes, they never see them. They showed me the man don't deserve to never come home. So yeah. I can't, you know what I'm saying? Like, I've never seen a man do shit to where, to where he didn't never deserve to come home. Yeah, that's hard. That's tough. Man. But you know, I mean, hey, I, I, at this point, bro, you got to pray for him because I, I can't really, I can't really comment on it. I got, I got, I ain't got no horse in this race. It, it, it's hard. It's to, hard too. Because you see a person who basically, you know, I just started listening to this boy in the 90s, early 90s, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And, and, the, and and to see this right here happen, I never would have thought. Yeah. But that's then, like, I wouldn't have thought on Bill Cosby either. I, not, I thought he was really like the Huxtable. I thought this nigga was a doctor and what nothing going on. I'm just being real. You didn't see that coming. But then you look and then they start I mean, bringing I'm going to tell you something, man. When you got a niche for women, you can tell what niggas don't. And you know, and don't, don't surprise you after that. 
The shit they do once a fight. You like, this nigga can't be no player, cuz. Like, this nigga ain't no pimp no hoe in there. This nigga don't know how to, like, handle no bitch. Like, he, you wear a sweater, goddamn me, with the wudu. You ain't handling. Like, I ain't saying you ain't tough, bitch, cuz you've been famous for a while. You probably know how to, but you know, something, it's different. He ain't it's never different really, ways to do it. He like, probably you know, never had to. If you ain't to. did it broke, you don't know how to do it with something. You know what I'm saying? That's like, real. I done did it with zero dollars. I done had to find it. So, imagine with the money, she for sure come with me. You yeah. did everything, get your paper. Yeah, no, you right. Yeah, you you right. Man, like I said, I, I just really be tripping off all the stuff because you relate. Like I said, I look at things that you was affiliated with that didn't happen, um, but you one of them ones that I ain't going to lie. I don't ever know how you going to come to be on this TV show now. <laughs> yeah. I'm being real. Like, I see you in the bed most of the time with the girl. That's, That's the first why y'all thing be he at. said. Hey. That's why y'all That's hang. the first thing yeah, he said. I shit. like that show. Yeah. Like they, they in the bed every time they come on. Cause ben, that's where a nigga ben really wanna a, be. Ben yeah, so but, but they yeah. not no power ben though. Ben they not a, they not no hey, power hey. doing all them. But let me tell you something. I'm gonna tell you some real shit. So that show was shot on stars. It was mm -hmm. shot by AMC the movie people. Stars is stars can do you can really have sex on that motherfucker. Really? It's really? consensual. Whatever they do on earth, we gotta have an intimacy coach in our shit. Like you can't even get between a girl's legs on, on we TV. Like it's a lot of little shit I was gonna do this bitch. Stop playing on video. You know what I'm saying? So, but you know, they wouldn't let us. They we had an intimacy coach. They had to ask each and that girl married. Mm. By the way, that I'm in a that I'm uh, Oh wow. Yeah, she married. So I was trying to be respectful. That's you know, good. How that. does your how your significant other, right? Uh-huh. Um, how does she feel about those those I mean, roles? I mean, she, she know what's going on. I just go and show her the real deal. <laughs> she, she get the trip and I go. So squat. in your role that you have now as um, Pop. Yeah, Pop Off. Pop Off. Pop um, Off. Pop Off. Um, how far is this from the real you? It ain't far. It ain't It far. definitely been a past life meet. Some of my, my 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 daddy and my brother said, "Boy, they, they must have knew you when they came. You gonna you gonna fuck that whole entire car." <laughs> I say, "Listen, that's the old me, man. You feel me? I've been through a lot of stages in life before I bossed up, mm -hmm. and it's just you know it's, it's experiences, but it definitely went too hard to uh, Cause, portray." Cause we had discussions um, in a part, and we was like, um, "She shouldn't have given him that key." That's what I was saying. She shouldn't have given him that, that key. She you get and, beat up. She ain't giving that shit. What she that gonna key. do? That's, that's right. That's what I'm like. She should have hit it. She should have took it and no, threw it away. I say, man, that man should have took that key and went on. She should have got out the way because that's a man. And get what, what if you don't want to be with him? Going on, on, give me or give me the keys. But guess what? But he could have been. But he could have been. He could have been stalking. Stalker trying to get yeah, to the bed. Where was we at? <laughs> I'm on, up man. to the bed and get up. I'm talking the clothes off. You deserve on, that car, man. nigga, after all that work. Come on, man. I was tired. Yeah, that I was deserve that car. I'm glad she did what she did, though. What's she doing? Just she taping, the, the, uh, taping it all the damn dust. That dirty. I'm throw a nigga away. <laughs> but you know, you did. I'm not going to say. I'm not going to say. I'm not going to say. I'm like, they teamed up. And they did what they did. That's all I'm gonna say. Now, hey, all I'm gonna say is stay tuned because this shit ain't over yet. <laughs> wow. I, so uh, and that, that's, my name ain't pop off for no reason. So uh, is there another <laughs> season coming, or is this is is it just just the first of many, or what? You gotta stay tuned. Damn man, that's how I don't like. Hey. I don't like really interviewing dudes that got something going because when y'all got y'all didn't go on to tell what's going on with the situation. Hey, man, just stay tuned. Stay tuned. I promise you, it's gonna get greater later. Hey, you know what's crazy? You said power. I wouldn't have looked at. I was looking at the show and I wouldn't have looked at like the first seasons of Power. I didn't realize how long Power been out because it seemed yes. so fresh and new. If you because look at the really first good. seasons, it don't look like it look right now. Yeah. You're like, wow, I was investing, I was investing into this. Mm -hmm. And as I'm seeing this show unfold, I'm like, it's giving me vibes of something that could just grow greater. Mm -hmm. People are genuinely liking this. Like I'm going out and I'm used to people stopping me like, you the dude from Love and Hip Hop or Solo Lucha, you got Now they recognize you. Now they this. like, I'll just send you on Cold and Wendy. You done took that girl car. I was like, okay, that's hard because it's, you know, it's a hard, you know, it's hard to live up to when you reach so high heights, you know, mm -hmm. like 20 million views a week, love hip hop, right. you know what I'm saying? I'm doing videos, 40 million views rapping. Now you're trying to top now, it. Now I'm trying to top it, and it's a whole new lane, so mm -hmm. it's like I'm, I'm challenging myself at the same time, I'm not afraid of the challenge. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.